Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Trophinet the Babbling Belgium, and this is The Last of Us Part 2. We're still in the Seraphites, it, it's actually what this, this chapter is called, so I'm not exactly sure if this is the area name or the name of the enemies, although I think those are the scars, I think we know that. Um, but yeah, we're inside of a, of a hotel right here, I'm not entirely sure, yeah, okay. So the game wiped my uh, searching from the last episode just a tiny little bit, because that's what this game tends to do. It doesn't give you uh, a proper save, it just saves to the last checkpoint you had, which kind of makes the save system um, useless. But yeah, that's just a, a little bit of a gripe with this game. It's really, It really feels like I need to redo like five or ten minutes worth of uh, looting at the beginning of every episode. But uh, this is the first time we actually get to see that. But let's stay quiet and see if we can find any of the scars up here that we need to kill. Because uh, these guys seem to be a lot more dangerous than the WLF, although they seem a bit less organized. Although I shouldn't even say that, because they were communicating with like different tuned whistles. And I have no idea if I need to use my listening mode here. This is a big room. This doesn't even seem like a hotel room of some sort. And as long as there aren't any enemies, I should probably just... Ah, oh, there we go. A collectible cards thingy. Doppelganger. Let's take a look at that. And it is a white alien kind of dude. Unknown. Okay. So basically a Doppler, like from The Witcher. You can take the shapes of anything it comes across. But, okay. So this is a side alley. Not a side alley. A, si a side alley. I know it's confusing, but one, once the girl that we're controlling and once, like, the area over here. So, hospital is over there. We need to go towards the hospital. So, I think this upper area is probably also worth exploring. Ooh, that sounded really creepy. I still don't hear anything. I'm gonna be careful nonetheless. This is gonna be locked, isn't it? Well... Uh, that is so, I feel like that's a little bit lazy because it just forces you to go around break the window There we go, and I'm gonna get jump scared by something. No, okay And we're just gonna scavenge around because I don't think we're gonna be finding anything spectacular over here Aside from this corpse a corpse that has been yeah There's a note right next to it and there's like a whole bunch of pills as well so that is nice at least but the note, we might discover what happened to this poor man, I suppose, it was Simon Vickers. If anyone finds this note, my wife Paige is waiting for me back yeah. in the old that conference sucks. center at Bike and Convention. So we knew, we read about that before, right? Right across from the brew pub. Please take her this medicine, she's pregnant and could die without it. But of course, yeah. He never made it back. I thought I could make it, but I've lost too much blood. I was sprinting through the woods, heard some whistles, and then an arrow pierced my side. I ducked into this place, think I'm safe. Can't get any worse, right? Starting to feel cold. Stole all this medicine from the hospital, should've grabbed some blood too. Bad jokes, never mind. She'll tell you I'm always making bad jokes. If you find Paige, tell her I went peacefully. Tell her I hope they, ha they live happy lives. Tell her I love her. And tell her if it's a boy, don't, don't, don't name the kid after me, go with the name we picked, Simon Vickers. So yeah, that's the story of Simon and Paige, because I think we found uh, Paige last time, it's been about a week since I played the previous episode, so yeah, again, sad ending to another story. They usually end the same way, everybody just dies, it's not, not too surprising anymore. Um, probably gonna have to be careful here. Oh, that's something I need to crawl through. Yeah, I think too, but you might get ambushed again. E, ooh, e, ooh, that's actually pretty tight. And got it. Yeah, he's just gonna take that all, isn't he? And there they go out. Now he is free. Now 
Now he's free. Okay. May she guide us. Wow. There's like at least six guys here. Did you hear what Lily did? I did. Shameful. But not all that surprising. Her sister, though. I was shocked. Their poor mother. Don't come over here. I sensed that something was off, though. Oh. Straggler! Ow! The wolf! Ow, yeah, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I know I'm not gonna survive this. Yeah, there we go, right in the gut. And the game kind of freaked out there. Okay, I'm actually wondering, can I save this guy? Uh, not anymore, I can't, because his, his intestines are already out. So I'm just gonna try and go around the sides here. So I have the bow equipped. There that goes. So now they're whistling to one another that stuff is going wrong. I don't think they know where we are just yet. Maybe I can recover one of my arrows from the corpse here. And otherwise, I can still make new ones. So that's the trap bomb. And I still have the silencer, by the way. So I could take... Ooh, but there's a lot of them now. Wait, what? Ow. I think there's one coming towards me. Right? Oh, wow. Okay, I just came out of cover. Oh, come on. I forged the first hit. Shit. And then there's another one. At least I'm using resources. <laughs> yeah, so there's one over there. I don't know if he's... If he needs anybody yet, does he know where I am? Oh, he does. There we go. Don't need to waste two ammos on that. Ooh, we actually have specialized melee weapons. Um, there's pistol ammo over here as well. Should probably heal up. I have enough resources, nothing too bad over here. And the healing, oh, look at that. 50% more healing on those health kits. Now, are there any more? Doesn't seem like it. So what we're gonna do is upgrade our melee weapon. Then mm, the rest I think we're fine with. Because I could technically just work around the other requirements. Um, I don't need to waste crafting anything over here just yet. That's a normal hammer. And every other thing, yeah, I would have loved another arrow, but it doesn't seem like we can scavenge any more over here. This guy is also dead. But yeah, that wasn't that wasn't perfect, but at least I got two stealth kills before we got into tr trouble. I heard something on the side. I don't think we're out of this just yet. I think we just got lucky that the rest of the gang didn't join up. Maybe I can find something on the corpse of that WLF uh, Soldier that was gutted. Maybe I should check that first. So back in the middle. Yeah, this is this is horrifying. There's nothing I can do about this guy, but there is a building over here. And there are people around the building. Yeah, okay, so there there we go. He's gonna come closer. There we go. And I think we can kill them in one hit. Like in the original Last of Us. With a... Ooh. That's, that's, that's healing. Okay, where's that other guy? So he's up there in the parking garage. I think I can crawl underneath here. And maybe recover that one arrow from this guy. Don't see the corpse anymore, though. So I think I got... Ooh. I think I can just grab him, right? There we go. Hello. Yeah. Goodbye. Goodbye. There is actual rifle ammo here as well, which is good. But the bow in this situation is going to be better, I think. So let's just reload the shotgun. And there's definitely still more where that came from. Um, do I swap weapon? 
I want to see if I can... I don't have the scope just yet, but over there... There we go! We missed one. That's a hit. That's... That's a hit. That's a kill. I don't know where the, the last one is going to be. Ah, oh, there's something. So I just wanted to shoot to get that extra bullet and not waste any resources that way. Now... I think... Okay, so there's at least two inside of the building here. Should probably take out the bow again. Is that silent then from a distance? And I think that I can crawl aside here and just climb up once. There we go. I got it. Oh, that facial expression was something. Uh, where's the other guy? I don't think... Ah, oh, come on. There we go, got him in the leg. Goodbye. That was maybe a bit too much, but... There we go. Let's grab all of that. That's more healing. I don't know, the music still indicates that there might be even more. I'm out of pistol ammo now. Uh, so let's go with the bow and arrow. I could probably make how many... I do still have two adhesive and stabby things, but I'm gonna keep the resources for now. If I don't need two extra arrows, I don't even need to make them. So I have plenty of ammo and all the weapons. So let's just explore this place first. So this seems like an old parking garage. Aha! We get even a free med kit here. That is nice. See, that's why I'm not automatically making things. If you can pick it up, why not just pick it up and leave it at that? So the parking garage seems to be empty. I think we drained it from enemies. But I'm still taking a look around to see if I can find any resources. There is a corpse over here. That yeah, seems to be... That looks like a Fedra soldier. And not just a WLF, although he also has a rifle. And again, I can't really do anything with rifle ammo at the moment. I'm just going to walk around a bit, because... According to listening mode, there isn't anybody around here anymore, so... Oh, there are... There is somebody over there. Uh, no, no craft ammo. I just want to swap. There are so many shortcuts in this, in this menu. There we go. So I think I saw him... Yeah, there he is. That was in the face. And I didn't hear anybody else freaking out about that, so that might have been the last one. Jesus. That it? Yep, I think that's it. And that means we can also grab that extra bullet down the here. Tommy, hope you're doing better than I am. I, I mean, Ali, you're doing fine. You just killed a, a whole squad of enemies <laughs> on your own. You're you're a badass. You don't need anybody's help. I think we've established that until up until now. So this is again a very wide open area. I don't really know where to go. Because I don't see the hospital anymore, but we kind of came from over there, so I think the hospital is going to be in this direction somehow. Because um, last time I got a, a sign pointing me in the right direction. But now I don't get the same courtesy from the game. Um, there's at least two guys that I killed around here. Fuck, more of them. That's three of them. So I'm going to... I'm going to have to come here anyway, so... There we go. Let's put that bomb over there. And just work our way around. There's one... Okay, so there's four people over there. So if I just put one in the cross here... I just need to pull back. Oh, there we go. So that's one down. And if they... If they come over here, I'm going to swap back to the bow. And then we're going to have to see. So there's something down there, but I think one of them is going to come in this direction. If he wants to. There he goes. Okay, I wanted to shoot him with a bow, but there we go. 
So he's behind the car. You can see of her. her. I think it's a her. That's two down with bombs. That's great because I needed to get rid of my bombs. There we go. And stab. Ooh, that was very close up, wasn't it? Ooh, a machete. That is really good though. So that has seven charges. I think that's it. Ooh. That means that I took out two with the oh, same bomb. Because there were four at the fucking beginning. So I must have killed two with that first bomb. Yeah, there's one over here. Oh, there's one half over here and one half over there, because that's... Oh, no, no, no. Yeah, definitely killed two people with that first bomb. That's good. Uh, so that means that we can actually craft another bomb. Um, and now we're full up on alcohol and rags. But I can make another silencer. Maybe another set of arrows? No, I'm just going to keep it like that for now. Uh, there does seem to be... An area down there with a the cafeteria and stuff like that, so that is good. But other than that, these guys didn't drop any ammo or, or such. They did come from up there, so I'm guessing we need to go up there eventually as well, or some somewhere in that direction. Ooh, this, this is a this is a big drop. Damn. Um, so that probably means I need to jump down. Okay, and that's exactly what we'll do. One, two, three. <laughs> Ow! And then drop down immediately because I don't know if they're gonna spawn more enemies. I didn't hear any whistling just yet. So, pretty low on resources, but if we move in here, we didn't need to break the window, there wasn't any other way of getting in here. But this seems to be pretty quiet as well. It's another. Uh, seems like a makeup shop, yeah. Definitely. A makeup shop with basically no resources aside. Yeah, this is the first thing I found. So like duct tape and some alcohol. I can't make anything with the alcohol, so let's just move on. Because Molotovs are usually not that effective on humans, which is why I haven't used them before. Oh fuck! Okay, hi. Um can I dodge? Oh no, I can't do anything. Hi. And there we go. So this is an arena. That's why there's nothing in here. Uh there we go. Oh, okay. Didn't really do anything about that. Oh, fuck. Oh, wow. Okay, never mind. How can I do open combat when there's two people shooting at me? Okay, okay, okay. Let's just... And there we go. Fuck. Yeah, dodge them there. Oh, what the hell? Yeah, okay. You've been in jail. Yeah, okay, never mind. That's right. Yeah. I think it's time for the single most powerful weapon the shotgun. There we go. And then. Then let's just go down over here. Now, let's calm down. So there's two, two people here. I have the revolver though. So I think if I just aim... Hey, what? Oh, what the fuck? Let's pull that out. Oh, what? What the hell? Okay, game is bugged. That was very bad. Come on, the collision detection on that. There we go. So the collision detection on that thing is completely broken. There we go. Fucker. Okay. Well, that was something. At least I'll be able to use my resources now. Ah, oh, health kit. Let's craft one. Because I need to anyway. Wow, that just put a huge drain on my resources in one go. Ooh. Let's grab that. And... Did this guy drop something? No. Wow. That, well, that was something. I did get a few headshots off, so that's good. But other than that... Ah, there, there was healing over here. Should have probably used that. But yeah. We managed to kill the big... 
the big uh, Seraphite, because they keep calling themselves Seraphite, although the older, the WLF has called them the Scars. But I think this must be the same faction, because they also were talking about her, uh, ba basking in her glory or something like that. It's, it's something cult-like. Cult I, don't, I don't really know what they said anymore. <laughs> we saw that on a, on, on a lot of posters and stuff like that, so let's just reload the revolver. And scrounge a bit more. Okay, so that was a pretty rough encounter. Let's just open the next door. Maybe there's another surprise behind this door. Door number two. Any other huge bald guys that want to smash my head in with a hammer? Because he actually, in that one death scene, he actually just crushed Ellie's skull. That was like a bit too much, I think. But fair enough. I feel like if Ellie can crush the skull of... Uh, of an infected, then that guy must have been be able to uh, crush the skull of a little girl. Well, a young woman, I should say, because she's uh, she's over 18, I think, in this game. I think so, right? Because this is four, year off, four years after The Last of Us Part 1, but uh, she, I think she was 14 in The Last of Us 1, so she's either, she's either 18 or 19, depending on when she's uh, she actually has her birthday. But for now, it seems like this is... Pretty quiet, so I'm just looking around a little bit to see if I can not stock up on any of my other resources. And with the rest of the office supplies we can still make more arrows if we want to, because I found another uh, entire piece of binding and half a piece of stabby stabby. So I think we might actually be full up on stabbies again, yeah. So if we find another melee weapon, we might be able to swap them out. Uh, I don't think, was this accessible? Did I make it harder on myself? Yes. Yes, I definitely made it harder on myself, but that's the way the cookie crumbles. So we're just gonna head back up. The Seraphites. It's a weird name, by the way. Is that because of the? Because I originally thought because the chapter is called Seraphites. Um, origi originally thought that this was the area that's called the Seraphites, but apparently the scars are also called the Seraphites. And there we have the hospital, so we can see it over there again. But this seems to be another combat arena. But not a lot of movement. Yeah, yeah, I know. That's the hospital. There, Nora. That's the hospital. But if Nora is over there, then she's probably dead. Because these guys have been uh, just as efficient as we were at killing uh, Washington Liberation Fronters. Oh, this is not good, is it? Yes, I am crawling. I know, this is hell on Ellie's knees and quads, but... Yeah, never what you know what, never mind. As long as there are no enemies popping up, I should be fine. Although I might get shot again by a random arrow straight in the shoulder. But going down, this seems to be I mean every single area looks like a combat arena to me. Anything around here? Oh this is This is water. This is water. So could dive down, but I don't know if that's really gonna help us. Maybe when we need to stealth it, but this is a very lovely area, by the way. It's been quiet for a long time now. There has been barely any music. So it kind of keeps me on edge that way. Uh, anything in the bus stop doesn't seem like it, but there's a hole in the wall on the left here and a set of stairs, so Having the high ground is always good. That's what Star Wars told me. And then we get to a pharmacy, which makes sense, because of course, pharmacies are usually pretty close to... Well, there's always a pharmacy close to a hospital, or at least there should be. And there we have another collectible card. Bath Mandar. I can check it out. Ooh, that's a really cool looking guard. She has a laser sword. Yes, I just called it a laser sword. Any enemies just yet? Doesn't seem like it. There's a lot of plastic bottles, which seems to me could function as, like, you know, canisters, but... Note, uh, to Tom. I keep hearing gunfire at all hours. We have no one to protect us from this crazy cult. We can't wait for the WLF to find us. We have to trek to their base and join them. I've started stashing supplies in the safe. Heading out to scout the best route. We'll be back with a plan ASAP. Be careful, MK. Yes, almost forgot. The code is 385523. 
So that is interesting. It kind of puts another spin again to the the Washington Liberation Front. Yes, of course, they're doing some horrible shit, as every faction actually does. But they were clearly also a protection from the, um, the scars or the seraphites or however they want to call themselves. And I've seen the hole in the wall. But I don't want to go there just yet. We know the code for a save, but we haven't seen a save just yet. So that's kind of the first time that happens. So let's go underneath here. And I need to crawl to get in here. There's the safe. But this seems to be too easy. Though there is a workbench in here as well. Which kind of makes me very... No, no, no. That's not the triangle I pressed. I don't want to get ambushed on a workbench again. Turn off the light. Thank you. Want to grab the pills. So that's that. Canisters. Okay, so this seems to be like a safe area. Give me a second to look around. And there we go. Safe open. And we got... Ooh, that's an explosive arrow. So that's good that we haven't crafted too many of those. A health kit I can't use. But the rest... Yeah, there's everything else I can't even pick up. So that means that we should probably take a look at our um, weapon upgrades. Because I don't know if we upgrade the capacity of the weapons. If we then can actually carry more ammo of said weapon. Because there's a lot of weapons that we occasionally run into the ammo cap. And it would be nice to be able to carry more of that ammo. But I don't think we'll be able to. Because the pistol is still at 20 I think. The shotgun I can't upgrade the capacity, yeah, and then the scope. I was hoping there was there were going to be some of the parts in the safe, but apparently not, so we're gonna have to deal with it like this. So let's go back out and see if we can reach the hospital. Okay. Oh wow. I'm gonna have to dive down here. Oh, wait. Those are WLF soldiers. But we haven't been fighting them. What the fuck are they talking about? Yeah. That doesn't make any sense. Um, okay, so we're inside something. Because I don't think we're close enough to the uh, hospital yet. So let's just take a tiny look. Wait a second. There's a big triangle down here. Um, oh, God. This is... Horrifying. I don't know why my health bar is empty all of a sudden. Ooh, I'm gonna make noise, aren't I? He probably hears that. How the hell do you not hear this? How the hell do you not hear that? Or oh, is that the woman that escaped? This is this Nora? Ah, so we can't attack her now, so this must probably be a friendly person. Don't make a fucking sound. Hands up. Oh, she's playing a PS Vita. Girl, Nora. Sure, yeah. Where is she? In the hospital. Where in the hospital? Yeah, they're, they're clearing out the upper floors. She's somewhere in there. Yeah, you shouldn't have done that. Yeah, that was really dumb. I mean, why do people always assume you need to kill everybody? Is that... Is that... Hotline Miami? I think she was playing Hotline Miami. So that's a, a PS Vita. That's a nice touch. Um, although I don't think... Didn't this game start in 2013? Was there a PS Vita? That, I think there might have been, yeah. So she found the PS Vita that still worked. PlayStation Vita that's still work. That is nice. Probably can't destroy it because it make, makes a lot of noise. You know what? I have extra rounds. Can we destroy this thing? <laughs> no, nope, we can't. Okay, I'm not going to waste any more ammo on that. I have an extra bullet here anyway, so that doesn't make too much difference. But scissors. I'm all, I'm all full on everything. Again. So let's just craft that again and grab the scissors. Or the stabby things, or whatever it, it is. Yeah, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You, you kind of put that on yourself. 
That was totally not my fault. What was she doing here, by the way? Because this doesn't seem like something that she wanted to guard. Was she trying to get... Was she just guarding the basement? That seems like a very shitty job. Or maybe she was just hiding out to play, uh, play that game. Let's go over here. How the hell did they not see that? Hey, we get the job done. I bet you do. Well, this is not fair. I'm telling you, man. Data soldier. It makes these shifts so much easier. <laughs> sure. I'll keep that in mind. Okay, so there's like a lot of dudes over Sounds here. Like I'm gonna swap swap with the bow. No no, don't stand up. Did you hear why we're all getting called up to the fob? I heard that Isaac wants us to retake all the downtown. I heard you might take the fight to Ah oh, crap, okay that dropped down something. a lot more than I, I got it. Oh. There we go. He died. He died, I'm fine. So that guy is walking around over there and there were at least two more. And I'm guessing there's even more than that. Yeah, there's one over there. Might as well... Uh, Chris! I think it came from back there. Chris died. So is he gonna try and grab? Ooh, crap, 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 crap. Move, 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 move. Move. Van out. Check the whole courtyard. Someone's out there. So I can go down the stairs while still in grass. I feel like I can grab this one without too much trouble. <laughs> Oh. Right here! Oh. Did I hear dogs? No, no, no dogs. No, 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 no dogs. No dogs, no dogs. Please don't eat my face. Please don't eat my face. Bye. Um, um, I don't have... Oh, God. So, let's just heal up. I don't know where the dog is. Fuck. Where is everyone? Uh, let's just swap this for the rifle. And you put the, the freaking menu away. Okay. So there's definitely people over there. She was there. Over there. That's one. Just gotta be careful if that dog wants to get any closer again. I think I'm gonna run over there now. Uh. Sorry, dog. Sorry, dog. So I'm gonna have to hide behind the dumpster here and let them come to me again. I could have put down another bomb. I keep forgetting about the bombs. That would have been really cool. Uh. Yeah, it's him down. Oh. Did I see something move over there? I think I cleared out most of the courtyard now. Because they don't seem to know where I am. I'm gonna reload the rifle because I seem to be getting a lot of rifle ammo. I got him. Shit! You do? Oh, wow. Okay. So that was... Was that a grenade? And after some patience... There he goes. There he goes. Wait, is there another one? That guy lost his face. Okay, so there's definitely somebody in there still. Uh, I'm gonna swap out to the the bow again. Because I feel like this guy might be... There we go. I'll check it out. So this one... There we go. I think that was it. Although it doesn't seem like it. There's plenty of people around here. And I need to really check out the area because I want to grab everything there is to grab. So I kind of went into the guard tower now and I feel like somebody saw me. I heard the, the whoosh noise. So there's definitely... Ah, there's somebody down there. 
Yeah, there's two guys down there. I don't know if I can shoot through all of that. I could probably enter the building on the left here. Yeah, I fucking killed her. Fucking killed a lot of them. And I'm gonna kill more of you still. Let's just drop down over here. That at least gets us inside of the building. Have to listen around. For any disturbances, but there's like very long sight lines in this building. This is definitely a hospital. There we go. We just killed her in one shot there, so that should be fine. Oh wow. Um, I don't know if they actually know where I am. I don't think they do. Um. Um. There we go. He's down as well. I think that's short. Now let's go back to the rifle. Can I see the other two? There were two on the hallway on the left. Yeah, there we go. There we go. There we go. That rifle is really powerful now that I've upgraded it to maximum damage. That was really good. So that was five more dudes. And the music is dying down and Ellie actually put her gun away. Which probably means that we're fine. That was again a lot. I killed a lot of people at this building. And it's a hospital for crying out loud. Really taking to Joel right now. <laughs> Murder Rampage Alley. Okay, let's find what let's see what we can find over here. So definitely worth checking every nook and cranny of this place. The game has been uh, prompting me to give a hint uh, every five seconds so far, but there is this door at the end of the hallway and I feel like this setting has been chosen deliberately. This feels really reminiscent of the uh, scene where Joel was going through the hospital at the Firefly base. So let's open that up. Push ourselves in between and then we can block that off again. Great, so we would hear there is a generator here, so they definitely have power, which explains the lights. But upstairs, what are we going to find upstairs? Oh, what the, f the hell was that? That didn't seem too normal. Uh, what was that? Alcohol. Yeah, I'm full up on everything. Um, so let's just push it open. This? Hello? Why is this so dark and quiet all of a sudden? This doesn't make any sense. There was a generator running downstairs. Um, yeah, I'm gonna have to read that like this. It's a supply list. Nothing, yeah, there's a bunch of stuff, but be sure to dig into the corners of the second floor. There are still rooms we haven't opened that might have things worth taking. Don't go near the lower levels, Sam. What? So this place is... Only recently occupied by the WLF, I'm assuming. Oh, I do not like that I get to see through the the windows here. Um, they also mentioned that somebody escaped, but no idea who that would be referring to, because we have Dina, unless they're experimenting on Dina already, which would be rather quick. This does not seem like a good idea to now push that open, because there were Quite a few men over there. Why are they not alarmed by the fact that everybody died in the front gate? Oh, this is gonna be bad. They're gonna see that drop down, right? There's other guys. This is bad. This is not good. I'm gonna drop down and they're gonna see me. Can you turn around, Deli? Okay. So there's... Aha! There's stuff around here. And there's supposed to be other people around here as well. I don't know where they went. It's more pistol ammo. Um, but let's go and confront Nora about this. Maybe we finally find out what happened to uh, Abby that made her so murder frenzy towards Joel. Because I'm guessing this is where that's heading. Or. Hello! That shit down.
You remember me? Yeah. You remember me. What do you want? Abby was here earlier. Where'd she go? I don't know. You shoot me. The sound will help every soldier come running. You'll still be dead. And that doesn't seem to be a problem for Ali. Tell me where she went and I'll think about letting you go. I also have a silencer, by the way. Could have killed you. Maybe you should have. Or maybe you should have stayed the fuck out of Jackson. Where's Abby? You still hear his screams? What? I hear them every night. Yeah. Yeah, that little bitch got what he deserved. You fucking... <laughs> ah! Chesterfield! Oh, come Stop on. That. Get Can't escape the this. fuck over here. Yeah, that's not gonna stop. Okay, that's apparently gonna stop me. Never mind. Um. There we go. Nope, 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 nope. I'm just gonna keep going right now. I'm just gonna keep going. Is nobody else following this, by the way? Oh, let's just run, let's just run, let's just run. Where the fuck did she go? No, oh, no, no! Oh, damn it. Got you! Oh! Oh, she's so gonna I'm pressing square already. She's gonna die. With a knife in her face. Ow. Come on. Come on. Oh, there we go. Throw down your weapon. No, I will not. No, I will definitely not. Yeah, let's just kick her down there. Goodbye. Don't go near the lower levels. Get your gun down. You can walk away from this, okay? I can Shut the fuck up! Gun down! Hands up! Get back! You have nowhere to go. I think we do. We go down the infected hole. No. There we go! Get downstairs! And of course, we're immune. Ow, ow, ow! Oh, she's infected, she's gonna die anyway. What the fuck's the power doing on it? Doesn't matter. Find the trespasser. Um. Headshot! Yep, there Take we go. Man! We're gonna have a little fun now again. Strike one infected! <laughs> Let's just go over here in the back and let them all just have a little fun. These girls, they want to have fun. Yeah, I think there was one in the back there, right? And there's one over here. Hiding out like a little bitch. There we go. Can I grab that gun, by the way? Because that feels like a very cool gun. One more charge in the silencer. So, and the infected are a nice distraction for all of the... Yeah, there's definitely still two more clickers. Um, you know what? I'm just gonna put... Oh no, oh no, oh no, 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 no! Let them come over here. And the bomb will go off. They wanna come over here, the bomb is gonna go off. Yeah, the infected got another one. Is he gonna go in here? Yes, he he's gonna run right into the. Oh, 
there we go. And then the other one. There's the other one. There's the other one. There's the other one. There we go. They died in one shot because they were uh, damaged already. That was fun. I think we went through that rather effectively there. One in the face with the silencer. And then a few got killed by the uh, the clickers. And that's that, I suppose. But I still don't know where Abby went. So I think if I can just take a little look see around, I might be able to find some more stuff. I was so lucky to still have a bottle in my inventory just to kick that off immediately. Because they got ravaged by those clickers. Oh, wow. Jesus Christ. What the hell is this? That is like... He was trying to crawl out of it, but what the hell? And there's a lot of infected down here. Which is kind of weird. I mean, it makes sense that they are like these things, but it feel like they were placed here. Or that it was growing out of people that were already dead. That would also be very, very weird. But I think there are no more infected, so that sh should allow me to uh, scavenge this entire area. Although it doesn't seem like there's much here. In fact, there's absolutely nothing aside from a few bottles in this area, which makes me think that you were actually... Oh, never mind, there's a few bullets over here. But that you're actually supposed to uh, get the clickers to fight the soldiers. Which is a nice touch. This was like shimmering, but there's nothing here. So that means that we need to go through the door that they used as well. I'm wondering if they'll be guarding this, because... I don't know if they expect me to come out alive, or just the people that were uh, trying to kill me here. Is Nora still waiting for me? Ooh, this okay. is... This is still... Infected Central. Where did this... Did we just all fell down the hole? They must have. I feel like this is the perfect opportunity for the game to just start throwing bloaters at me. I don't see anything yet. But that doesn't mean anything. Stalkers are uh, a big problem, but... It seems like the infection is so severe over here that stalkers would do... Well, this area not much justice because it's, you know, it's heavily infected, which probably means that there is a... Uh, wait a second. Can you go behind here? Yeah, I did. Um, that uh, runners and stalkers wouldn't already have evolved into clickers or bloaters. Although, I heard something. I hear like little screams in the background. Oh no, it's Nora, of course. Nora just went in here because Nora's still alive. Nora just got infected. Ooh, I can actually go... No, I can't go in here. Never mind, so we're just gonna have a little chat with Nora, I suppose. Nora. Nora. I've come to finish you off, Nora. I am Super Ellie. Super Murder Ellie. Going to stab you in the face. Hello. Well, the infection is going to be the least of your problems, Nora. Yeah, I think we're going to have a little fun here. So, hi. Seriously? Oh. Come on, Nora. Tell us. Wow, that actually works quickly. Look at their veins. Where's Abby? Breathing spores. Well, technically, you are too. You're her. You firefly? <laughs> there are no fireflies anymore. Glad we kindly finally get confirmation on that. Where's Abby? I'm fucking dead anyway. Why would I tell you anything? If she can make it quick. Because I can make it quick. There we go. Or I can make it so much worse. Do 
think about what he did. How many people are dead because of him? Last chance. Uh, Ali kind of joined that group, by the way. I'm not giving up, my friend. Okay. I don't think I get a choice here. I don't think Ali's just gonna decide for me. Oh wow, I get the choice. Do we actually do this? Because I feel like, I mean, I'm gonna, I'm gonna hold this off. Okay, can we hold this off? How much time do we get? You can just let it die here. Can we just let it die here? Come on, come on, keep her there. Look at how angry she is. She is ready. Just okay. Never mind. I don't have the patience for this. Goodbye. Oh, I can hit her again. Okay, this is this is yeah, definitely put that in my hands. There we go. Okay, let's just finish this off right now. Let's just end it there. There we go. Okay. So the fireflies are definitely all dead. Nora just confirmed it for us. Well, not technically all dead. I'm assuming part of them went into the Washington Liberation Front. And that's basically what the uh, fireflies turned into. But yeah, that was a trip. By the way, remember that Joel actually had a period... He told, a, he told us about that in the first game, that he had a period that, together with Tommy, he was part of a group of raiders. So he might have done something before... It might have something to do with before Ellie actually met Joel. Hello, Dina. Are you okay? Christ. Is that your blood? Uh, no. She's hiding out in the in this aquarium. Okay. How did she find that out, by the way? It's cleaned up. This is heartbreaking. Arms up. <laughs> yeah, that looks about right. It's weird to finally see the effects combat in a video game, because it, it is still a video game, but combat like that would have on your body. She's tough, but not untouchable. I made her talk. Okay. Ah, okay, wow, okay, that was really weird. Two years earlier. Oh, stop showing us shimmer, you assholes. The horse is dead. Pediatrics. And we're in yet another hospital. Wait, is that the hospital that... Is that the hospital from the first game? 
I don't remember it too well, but on that bombshell, we're gonna take a little break. Because, um, yeah, we've, we've been going for uh, an hour and 20 minutes right now, so that seems like a good point to end it at. It's been a heavy episode as well, so thank you guys enormously for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. And when we get back, we're gonna go through yet another hospital, which I think is the same hospital where Ellie was almost killed by the fireflies. So, uh... That's for next time. Thank you guys so much for watching. See you in the next episode of The Last of Us Part 2. Goodbye.